Hey everyone, this is Brett with Mindfire Computer Services. Today I'm going to show you how to reboot your web server using your WHM panel and also explain the differences between a graceful reboot and a forceful reboot. The first thing we need to do is log into our WHM panel. So we're going to go ahead and log in. And once you're in, you're going to see a panel that looks sort of like this. On the left hand side, we're going to look for a system reboot category. We're going to click that and open it up. Here you've got two options, one for a forceful server reboot and the other one for a graceful server reboot. Depending on what's going on with your server, you may need to choose a forceful or a graceful reboot. <clears throat> a forceful reboot is basically like holding down the power button on your computer to turn it off and then pressing it again to turn it back on. It's not going to allow all your data that's open and access to you know save back to the hard drive it's not going to kind of give the system a heads up um, a graceful reboot is going to let everything close down properly make sure it saves all the data so you don't get so you don't lose any data and allow it to come back up properly as well today I'm going to go ahead and do a forceful reboot my server has locked up and I need to get it back up and going Whenever you do a reboot, you're going to have a warning that shows up um, letting you know that you're fixing to reboot your system and it wants you to confirm that as well. When you do a forceful reboot, it's going to alert you that there could be data loss. Generally, that's going to be if someone's on your server doing something, they are going to be kicked off and anything that they were working on might not be saved as well. We're going to go ahead and proceed with this, and it's going to let us know that the server is being rebooted. Generally, this can take up to a few minutes to reboot your server, sometimes a little bit longer. It kind of depends from host to host and server to server. Um, but that's the process. It's fairly simple. Once it starts, you just got to let it run. Thanks for watching this video. Have a good day.